Yeah, you know, it was a tough battle. We knew we were going to play a good team. Uh, I give a lot of credit to Lake Superior State. They they made plays all night. You know, I, we got them down early and, um, you know, kind of put them on a run, and they ran it right back at us. Um, <clears throat> and it was back and forth, you know, the whole game, and we just – didn't have quite enough at the end. You know, I thought their guys made some plays, made some big shots late in that game, and uh, we, we stayed on their heels and, you know, gave ourselves a chance throughout the whole thing, but just just didn't have quite enough at the end of that thing and didn't get a, enough stops, basically. Uh, you know, but it, it, at this time of year, it's always going to be a tough one. You, you have to play pretty well to win games, and we just fell a little short. They're a very high-powered offense. Uh, they shoot it very well. they got guys that can stretch the floor, so it's tough to really pinch and help off those shooters and they make you pay for it. And, you know, I give them some credit. Uh, Devin got going for him a little bit late in that game. And, you know, delhi has been so good all year when we switch and do some of that stuff. We've been able to eliminate point guards that way. And um, he was just one of those. He was making them take the floaters. He was making them take tough shots. And the kid made the shots. Uh, it's nothing against Delhi. He's done it all year and got stops and won us a bunch of games guarding like that. And it just... It didn't happen tonight. Um, and then we lost a couple of shooters when we didn't need to lose them, missed a couple of rotations, but uh, that's basketball, man. That's this time of year, and uh, it's just it didn't go our way tonight. Yeah, I mean, offensively, I thought we did enough to win that game. We, we had some guys make some shots, and uh, we just didn't keep the flow going. You know, when you're grabbing the ball out of the, the net more times than you're, you're getting rebounds, it's, it's tough to, to get that tempo going the way we want to play. So. Uh, but I thought our guys executed. They got good looks most of the night. They, they were physical at getting to the rim, and it's just we just fell a little short. Uh, you know, Christian obviously being new this year, being a one-year guy, came in and, um, you know, had a good year for us and was able to stretch the floor and do some things for us. Uh, he's an awesome addition. Him and his family are just good people, and it was, it was fun to have him as part of our program. And, you know, you can't say enough about Jake and what he's done, you know, for this program and where he's taken us and, um, and how far he's elevated this program. So, you know, I'm proud of him and what he did. Uh, he didn't have to come back for a fifth year. You know, he definitely could have went and played pro already or, or moved on to a higher level. But, you know, he's a loyal dude. He wanted to come back and make a run, and, and we were able to make that run. Now, we fell a little short, uh, but, you know, not because of effort, not because of what he did or what the other guys did. It's just the way the game works. But I'm proud of our guys. Um, I felt like we were just as good as anybody in this tournament. And, you know, if the ball would have bounced a little different tonight, we could have made a run and, and won this region. You know, I feel confident that we can compete for championships in this league, and I thought we proved that this year. Um, it, it was an unbelievable year. Anytime you get a chance to compete in an NCAA tournament, it's a, it's a great year. And uh, I'm proud of our guys and what they've done this year. It, it, it hurts right now. Um, but, you know, it's something we'll look back on and, and be proud of in the future.